one's more complicated than the other ones. You do have a limited time to do these things. If you take too long, then if you take too long welding, then then it will like it won't work, and you'll have to start over again. All right, let's go. Yes. Okay. Well, mines. Another mine. Bloody mine. Those things are hard to see. If you're not expecting them. They're very difficult to avoid. And there's a missile expansion. I can't get that quite yet. Oh, more of these annoying swarm enemies. Out. But it seems that disrupting the swarm doesn't kill them, at least not all of them. Some of them you have to kill individually. Annoyance level increased. Alright, I'm going to kill this puffer before I kill him. I don't know why it tells you how to use a screw attack when you've already had to use it. Yikes. Alright, I'm out of here. Alright. Oh, more of these annoying dudes. Not as annoying since you can kill them in like one shot with the plasma beam. What's in here? fire and then let it burn. That's good. Okay. So, here's another part of the bomb. And, I don't think I can get past it. Yeah, it's blocking my way. I'll need to get somewhere else. Unfortunately, I can't use that elevator because it's stuck. Wait a minute, is there anywhere else I can go? It would be handy if I had a map of this area. Well, there are a few doors I haven't tried, but I don't know if I can try them. This is where I just came from, but I think there were a couple of doors. Wait a minute, I only want to run. Did I get him? Yep, I, wait, thought I got him. Alright, I got him that time. Oh, maybe I can get rid of this. Alright. Okay, yes, I can get it out. Here's another data bot, if you're interested. I don't think anything happens if you shoot the non-enemy robots. Besides the data bots. Puffers are almost invisible. More energy. Yep. 
All right, more bots. Should I bowl them over? Yeah, I'll try. Oh, crap, Piper Mode bots. How is it that everything can suddenly go into Hyper Mode? I mean, I can only do it because I have this sleet, you know, phase on enhancement device thing. Like everyone getting infected with phase on whatever. Remember the first two games, phase on like didn't do good stuff to you. It didn't make you more powerful. Well, it did in some cases, but usually it just made you like go crazy and stuff. Well, that was close. Alright, so here's another landing site. And this is another special landing site. Thermos, I will unlock this area, allowing you to command your ship to land. Ah, can't scan that. <laughs> yeah. So. I don't know why they have to make these sites locked in the first place if the Aurora unit just unlocks them immediately anyway. Anyway, like I said, this is another special landing site. Special in that it lets you, uh, lets you, uh, upgrade your ship. And this is the last upgrade that I'll get to my ship. So to use the upgrade, you follow the beeping. And that looks like a grapple beam signal. I wonder what this does. Like the other one back on Brio, it shoots beams into your ship. And this one adds a ship grapple beam. Uh, as with the missiles, you use the command visor. Samus, now that you have the ship grapple, you should be able to assemble the Theronian bomb. We will upload the coordinates to all three bomb components to you now. So, not surprisingly, the ship grapple beam can grab hold of objects far larger than Samus can with her personal grapple beam. It's not useful for that much other than this mission, but it's kind of cool. And with that, I will end the session. Uh, this is Thinker2112, and I will see you next time.